Dozens filled theater Charlotte Sunday to watch an eight minute film about transgender Charlotte teenager Blake Brockington. I mean, a lot of people still know who I am, but it's not necessarily a positive connotation with my name. Filmmakers shot the documentary last year, weeks after Brockington was crowned the homecoming king of East Mecklenburg High School. His spirit is like very energetic, real a go-getter, someone who like lights up a room. Sergio Ingato and his classmates from Elon University say they got to know Brockington during the semester they worked on the film, and they say the news of his suicide last month hit them hard. We were totally shocked. I mean, I almost dropped my phone when I heard the um, what happened. But but Mason Sklut says it made them even more determined to share Brockington's story in hopes of spreading awareness about those who are transgender. Just to promote tolerance, to promote, we should like love everyone for who they are and I feel like this film especially just shows that. An encouraging message, advocates say. As more trans people come out, more people get to know them, that's kind of the snowball effect where inclusion and affirmation is just going to come more naturally now. The filmmakers say now their goal is to get schools to show the documentary, to teach students a lesson of acceptance. I didn't hear the word transgender in middle school or in high school. It's not something you hear from your classroom. That should be taught in health class. You should be talking about that. I definitely think that Blake's story can affect life still. Yeah, without a doubt. In Charlotte, Jenna Barnes, Time Warner Cable News.